Ever wonder how I change my substrate when I have 16 hermit crabs? Let's find out. <laughs> idea for a while and I like, I like to call it molt cycling. Now this is the process in which you um, take crabs out of your tank and you place them in another tank. Now to be more in depth about this, I have 16 hermit crabs. I can't change out my substrate while I have a crab molting and there's always a crab molting when you have a lot of hermit crabs. So how am I ever going to change out my substrate if there's always going to be someone molting? Well, here comes in this idea of molt cycling, which is actually an idea that I believe I created. If I'm wrong, please correct me. Um, but it's where you basically have another tank, and all the crabs that aren't molting get moved into the separate tank, so that the one you want to clean has only molting crabs in it. So as the crabs that are in your tank that you want to clean, as they come up from their molts, you transfer them into the other container or the other tank. So eventually you end up with no crabs in the tank you want to clean and all of your crabs in the tank you don't want to clean. So then you can clean your substrate in the tank and then put all the crabs that aren't molting in the container back in the tank. So let me show you how this works. All right guys, I'm over to hand filming now. Sorry for the instability, but this is my second tank for molt cycling. I'm just closing these doors right here. This is my second tank for molt cycling. That's the tank that I want to clean. So as you can see, this is a 50 gallon plastic storage container, which serves the crabs really well for their time being. So you may ask what's inside. Well, I have about seven hermit crabs in here out of the 16 that I have in my tank. So right here, this is an LED light. I can switch it over from blue, nothing, to white. White is obviously for day. Um, I've got my air pump that I use for that tank. That's set up right in here. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I do have a heat pad inside. So let's go ahead and open this baby up and see. And it reveals the inside. So right there is my, one of my heat mats. Um, you can see there's two hermit crabs right there. One of them has chaya seeds on top of it. It's kind of funny. Um, and then we have another two crabbies right there. So yeah, I'm not sure what the other ones are. They're somewhere in here. But there's my bubbler. As you can see, it's only bubbling that pond. But so right here, it's temperature wise. We're sitting at 76 Fahrenheit and about 90% humidity. Now this is great, especially for one of these temporary tanks. All right, so I realized this idea is very close to ISOing your crabs. And as it is very close, it's not as close. So if anyone else has come up with an idea like this or has done something like this before, please notify me. But if I'm the first one to come up with this, I hereby call firsties. Um, thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day.